Leaders on board, they're made. And they're made just like anything else through hard work. That's the price we gotta pay to achieve our goal. Let's get it. Last of a dying breed, heart of a lion. All of my soldiers with me, we alright. Ain't no stopping once the red light turn green. I would not lose, I know they heard me. I tear them apart if they let me. Ask me if we ready for war. I'ma tell you, we ready. Fresh off the block, we ready. Coming for their top spot, we ready. That's right, we came to win. I'm going in. Next thing we're gonna go over is shooting off the dribble. A few points that we're gonna cover is your feet, what your feet do, um, your, the bounce to pocket speed, so how fast that ball is dribbled and then pulled to your shooting pocket, your hips again, um, your release, how to stop your momentum from going left to right, and the direction that you want to be going when you shoot the ball. Okay, so a couple things. When you're going right, anytime you're dribbling the ball right and you're gonna pull up, Footwork is inside foot, okay? So if I'm dribbling right, my left foot goes down, and again, it's just the pivot to get square, and then I shoot the ball, okay? The left, right, the one, two step is very much a rhythm thing, and we wanna keep that, we wanna stress that, it's very important. Now, if I'm going left, my inside foot again is my right foot, I'm gonna plant it, pick the ball up, pivot, and then again, I go get into my shot, okay? Bounce to pocket speed, very important, okay? This is how fast the ball dribbles and then is pulled to your shooting pocket. So when I dribble the ball and I'm gonna pick it up, so if, I, if I'm going right, okay, I'm gonna dribble it and I'm gonna plant my left foot, okay? When I dribble it, I'm gonna pick it up and I'm gonna pull it as quick as I can to my shooting pocket. And then on the dribble, your hips gotta be flexed, your knees gotta be slightly bent, this is going to help with the rhythm of the shot, how quickly you get the shot off. So as I dribble, once the ball hits the floor, my, that's when my hips are going to drop and my knees are going to bend, okay? As I pick it up, I'm ripping the ball to my shooting pocket, so I dribble, I'm bent, I pick it up, I pull, I'm pivoted, and then it's, it's the same shot, okay? Same exact shot as if it's a regular jump shot. It's just the preparatory work, to get into your shot, that is very important when we're talking about uh, shooting off the dribble. And now if I'm, going, if I'm going left, same thing. As I dribble, I'm bent, I pick it up, I'm pulling it across my body, I'm planting and I'm pivoting to get square. Once I'm square, I'm just straight up and down, same shot every time. Uh, again, focus points. Even if you're, going, if you're going more straight and you're not necessarily going you know, left to right, but I'm going more straight at my defender. If I'm dribbling with my right hand, my left foot's going down, okay? And I'm trying to pull, okay? So I'm pivoting, I'm pulling my back foot through, I'm sat down, and I'm extended. If I'm dribbling with my left hand, okay? I'm on my right foot, my right foot goes down, pulling it to my shooting pocket, my left back foot follows, and I'm up into my shot. Um, Quickness of your shot. Something you want to get out of or you don't want to do is you don't want that little shuffle at the end. A lot of players do it, okay? So if I'm going right and if, if at all possible, I can take one dribble, one step and pull out of that, quickness, rhythm, much more effective. Those are the points that you really want to concentrate on. It's again, your feet, your feet, your feet, your feet, hips down, knees slightly bent, ball to my shooting pocket as fast as I can get it there. I'm on balance, jumping straight up and down. Those things you can focus on as you practice, your game will expand, you can shoot off the dribble, and you become a more effective player. Let's go. How about you? It's not a game. It's more than a game. We ready. We ready.